Bueno día. I know guys, it's only one bueno día and that's Suzette's fault because she deleted all of the morning vlog during this video. We can do a vlog without the bueno día, so at least I'm gonna give you one. But this also gives me a big, big, big opportunity to ask you guys for help. So I have a job, yes, I have a full-time job. I work for a call center and we did a competition. We had a competition, now it's turned into a global competition. i is a global company. So, just to keep it short, they give us like 30 minutes with our team to create a quick, fast video. Basically, what does customer service mean to us? We're a call center and we do customer service. Me and my team, we created this video. If you guys wanna see who I work with, who I manage, and who I supervise, and my team, you can watch the video. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and put it up in like 10 seconds. But the most important part is, in the description box, there's gonna be a link. It's gonna say, vote for team martin that link will take you over to my video and you don't have to watch it all you have to do is press the heart which is gonna like it the most likes by tomorrow gets to the second round and i'll explain what happens tomorrow all right guys let's show them how big the royal fam is this is a global competition and i wouldn't freaking be able to like you know bum away today we live in a society where customer service is dead Everyone is more focused on themselves and their electronic devices. We rather take selfies, text, have phone conversations, and check social media. Watch a TV show or YouTube. We even listen to music to ourselves. What would happen if we put these distractions away? Let's bring this back and start all over. The best way to provide great customer service in the workplace is by practicing it. Nothing but depressing songs are playing. You hear that? I don't want to die. Okay. Sorry, but I accidentally deleted the video that you deleted that you recorded from this morning. Wow. Like from not too long ago, you recorded a video, right? You opened the vlog? Yeah. I deleted it. Oh my gosh. I thought it was like old footage. I just deleted it. So the reason why this vlog is starting in the right now, like right now, right now, is because I just got done deleting footage that Martin had recorded from earlier today. Dang, that sucks, man. Because now we just have this to start our vlog and it's 5 p.m. We're still gonna kill him. Let's go. Fun? Mason. May May. Mason, wake up, Fupa. Damn it, people always uh, Don't be not vlogging. Editing the root, killing the vibe over there. Mason, no, but she's gonna freaking, she's gonna get in there and, and, uh, and jack us, bro. Oh, she, she's already gonna jack us. It is what it is. Get up, kid. We hear it, yogis. Mm. Can we get um three water cups? Sure. Yeah, thank you. You're so welcome. Total comes to 32.04. Look at my cuddle, what up, today? Super Martin, stop. Mason, why are you doing that face? Stop. I'm over here trying to tell you guys that he's a super, being a super cuddle bug today. And he's all over there looking pissed and I didn't even realize he's like this. <laughs> That's a sour patch right there. Huh? Or is that the Grinch? Is that green cheese? Is green cheese season here? Damn, dude, I freaking miss this so much, babe. Where's yours? They haven't brought you yours? How's that new drink you got, dude? This thing's weird. It's got like a little glass thing. Mason, do you like your chicken and rice? Yeah? What about the broccoli? No? Yo, what happened to you saying you're not gonna eat any more meat? Suzette, that was like... I never even took it seriously. You're Are you kidding me? It. Okay, I tried to run with it, but it's you mentioned it. Me feel like no, like listen. It makes me like... I'll eat real meat, not fake meat, not McDonald's. Like Hypocrite. 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 What do you mean? You're saying it makes you feel like a chef, but look at you. Seriously though, like he said, like 
Before Brenda came, he was like, oh, I'm not, I'm not gonna eat meat anymore. Then Brenda comes, she's like, let's put chicken meat. Oh, all right, I'm like, this is the last time. Y míralo. He you just can't do it. Just admit it, like, it's too hard for you. You can't do this. It's too natural, you know? You just can't do it's it. too natural. Like, what am I supposed to eat? Freaking nothing with rice? Martin, shut up, this, no? <laughs> Guys, this is not what I'm eating, by the way. I'm getting a little thin. Kill him. And I asked for extra crisp, which is funny because I was making a Martin because he's so like picky with his food texture. Like he likes certain food texture to cook and texture a certain way. But this one, like I like my salmon cooked extra crispy. But look, this is mine. This is Big Mama's. Pa que no digan que no, no. Why does it sound like that? I don't know. Your perros are freaking sweaty. <laughs> Shut up. Suzette, it's the bottom of my sandals, not the inside. You nasty f. Suzette let us out today, cause all we ever do. Is homework, study, homework. I know. Guys, I didn't do homework Listen with Mason yet. Bitch I didn't about do homework. homework. I literally said Listen the kid today. bitch about homework. Yeah. So. And yesterday I had like a meltdown with like just so much stuff. You guys like we have we always have so much to do. So like today I was like, we free. Like Thank nothing. God, we do stop also, Martin. Together, stress me the hell out. <laughs> well, we hit cursing left and right, but that's the only uh choice they give me nowadays. But check this out, dude. It's not bad. Look. You like this one? You like that uh -huh. color? Hmm? You want to check another one or what? Because that's all they have. They basically have those. Or these right here. These are comfy. What size are you? What size are, you, are the perras? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see let's those perronas, them. no? Let's try <laughs> oh, try on the perronas. Let me see. What? <laughs> yeah, the kids are. The kids are. Yeah, please. Maybe wants to listen to that. See, that's what you grab the chili like always, bro? Come on. Try them on. Come on. Imagine being freaking being our child. You Come know on. how annoying we can get. I just want to know. You know, he gets annoyed <laughs> a little But one day he's going to watch his videos when he's older. He's going to get his Damn, back. We Come wish. On. No. No, what? You don't even know what you're saying no to. Let me see. Try on the perras. They're a lot more comfy than these, dude. The kid dude, looking look. like he hasn't showered in months. <laughs> I know, dude. That's all it Why takes. One little outing. Yeah, one outing. Look at the kid. I swear. A little teriyaki. Oh, kids gotta stay clean to save their lives. Like, yeah, fuck it. Why try sometimes? That's how I feel some days. That Loyal Royal merch, though. The Royal Daco. Link in bio. So we're trying to buy him this. No, Warren, stop talking. Right. Oh, we're just looking yeah, kind of. Thank you. So then, look, this one's smaller than this one. Oh, I I started with like six and a half hours later. Uh, you like those, Bubble? Yeah. I really can't with your teriyaki face. Let's go clean them off. <laughs> Come here, let me put some saliva on you. Come here. Oh my gosh, look how cute these are. Warren. When are you used to? You like a Bubba? Just try for them your, for, for your, old time's uh, sake. For your sister, bro, what do you think? <laughs> don't need punch in them. You don't want a sister? Lord. What about these real chanclas? Try them on, Mason. Put the perras in there. Those are cute, huh? Put the perras in there. No, Mason, don't do that. You don't like them? The darker ones, then. They're nice, Mason. They are nice. They're like wooden oak. Mason, come on, they're only $10. You're taking these. They match your they match your shorts, bro. Look at your shorts. Oh, he just lifted. Oh, Martin, stop. <laughs> no, did he lift them up last? You're taking these, boy. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, I'm joking. Really, Suzanne? Just for you? Just so you can crack your back? You are royal! Okay, can you help me? What do you mean, I help you? I to get up. This one's good, bro. Come on. Give me a hand. Ugh. Hello from the other side. That's a good singer right there. Hello from the other side. I must have called a thousand times. Hey, young boy, you got the musandos, huh? He actually decided to go with these. Mason got his, puppy got his. Now, mommy, now, mommy. Now, mommy wants hers? Yes. I'm gonna wear them all day. You're gonna wear them all day? <laughs> but not a sip at school. Not yeah, school, huh? Cute. <laughs> this is moment. This is moment. <laughs> See, now you know. Now you know why I wear mine all day. So Mason hates the fact that I wear these bad boys all day. To pick them up, to oh, drop them off, to play that. football, everything, huh? It's funny because now you gonna wear yours or what? Mom mm -hmm. in there? Uh, um, Does the women's have a couch in there, bro? Yeah. Uh -huh. What up, Jerry? Chinigga. 
Thank you. Thank you. You feel good to me, boys. You gotta get your protein in, no? Give me that handshake, bro. We home now. Now you gotta do homework, huh? The kid actually wants to do some homework right now. Ooh, I'm gonna take out my hat. Do the hair looking. <laughs> Since when does Mason want to do his freaking homework, man? Mason. <laughs> what the hell is that? You okay? <laughs> What's your I deal? Need to talk about something real quick. <laughs> Sliding around the house is too much fun, but I don't know. Freaking got me hurt, but I'm out of breath. Hold on, I'll be back. Okay, I had to catch my breath because I was sliding all around the house and I couldn't really talk to you guys. But I just wanted to take a second to let you guys know that we have a royal who is six years old. His name is Ray, which how ironically cool is that? Because Ray means keen and keen means you're royal and he's a natural royal. He's a day one royal, but I thought that was pretty cool. But his mom reached out to me and she just kind of wants to bring awareness. Ray has severe hemophilia and that is a disorder where your blood does not clot. Most of you know that if your blood is unable to clot, that can lead to higher and more dangerous risk. Him and his family have partnered up with an organization that hosts the walk every single year um, here in Phoenix, Arizona at the Phoenix Zoo. So if you're here in Arizona, you can sign up for the walk under their team name, Our Hemo Ups and Bumps. Now, if you can't go to the walk for some reason, but you still want to be able to donate, you can go ahead and do that. We will post the link and all the information down below. Just make sure you check our description box. And Ray, we're thinking of you. We're praying for you. We love you. Thank you for allowing us to help you bring awareness to this. So thank you, Adriana, for reaching out. But thanks for listening to me speak on this. More than anything, they just wanted to bring awareness to this. So we love you, Adriana. We love you, Ray. Thank you for allowing us to help you. Um, help spread awareness so and thanks royal family for listening to me talk Mwah. I don't think I need the vlog here though now yet are we running be obsessed with improvement be obsessed with improvement and like the lion go from a gazelle to a lion why because if you don't kill it then your family won't eat